I'm going to show you how to make a quick and simple fish pie. This could be used with either a tin of tuna or a frozen piece of cod. To start off with, you need some mashed potato that you pre-made, a tin of tuna, half an onion. I've only got a red onion. Normally, I like to use a white onion because it doesn't colour the sauce. I've got some frozen peas, some frozen sweet corn and to make my all-in-one cheese sauce I'm going to use butter, flour, cheese and milk. First of all I'm peeling my onion and then cutting the shoot off, using the claw, slicing it into tiny little fingers towards the root, remembering to leave that 10 centimetres at the end. I'm going to go to claw because it's starting to get a bit slippy and then dice all the way along. What I normally do with this is I normally put it into the microwave for a minute just to slightly soften it with a tablespoon of water. If you haven't got a microwave Lightly fry your onions for a minute on the hob. Then place into your serving dish and add your defrosted cod or your tin of tuna. On the hob, put in your 25 grams of butter, your tablespoon of flour and your 250 millilitres of milk and stir continuously on a medium heat with a whisk. As the butter melts, you'll see it start to rise to the top of the pan. So keep stirring, because soon this sauce will start to thicken. My sauce is lovely and thick now, and at this point you can either turn it into a parsley sauce if you have fresh parsley, or you can turn it into a cheese sauce. Now I'm going to do a little bit of both. I've got some dried parsley. I'm just going to add a little bit in there for flavour. And of course, my salt and pepper. So pepper, I like pepper a lot. A little bit of salt. And some grated cheddar. I've stirred everything into my lovely thick creamy cheese sauce. Now into my dish, I'm going to add my sweet corn. And my frozen peas. Obviously, these are added extras, you don't have to add those two. Got a little stir around. And then on top, add your sauce. And then over your pie, spoon carefully your mashed potato so you don't. Mix the sauce with the potato. <laughs> Have you paused it? No. <laughs> Once you've covered it with your potato, add yourself a sprinkling of cheese to both of your pies, or your pie, depending. Get an oven glove and place it in the oven for 20 minutes. So they're going to stay in the oven now for about 20 minutes until they're golden brown on top at 180 degrees, gas mark six, okay? And then when they're ready to eat, serve with some lovely cooked vegetables.